Hey guys, what is up? Thanks so much for tuning into another video, guys. Today, today is it's gonna be a good one. We are gonna go over some spring accessories that I cannot put down. It's like every time I leave the house, I have to have at least one or two of these items on. And so I'm just gonna share them with you so that you know if you like them, you can go ahead and pick them up too. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the video. Okay guys, so the first item is a pair of sunglasses. That is definitely a must have because you definitely need to protect your eyes, protect your face, all that important stuff, as well as look fly, okay, while doing it. So this pair of sunglasses, I cannot put these down every time I leave the house. Do you see that? Okay. Yeah, every time I leave the house, I have to have these on. And I have a lot of other sunglasses that I really love. Like I've really um, curated my little sunglass selection, but these have to be my favorite. They are very delicate, but I have been so careful with these because I love them so much. Like when I don't have them on, they're either in the case, they're up high, they're somewhere where they won't get, they won't be sat on, they won't be stepped on, anything like that. I'm just gonna come back in and let you see, okay? Mm-hmm, do you see that? They are so, so good. I'm gonna try to include the, the description or the name of them below so that you can pick them up if you like them. But trust me, you need them, sis. And I might just go ahead and keep them on for the rest of the video. I might just do that because even though they look like they have Fs and that I can't see out of them, they are transparent on my side and then you get the Fs on your side. Yes, girl. Okay. So the next item that you're gonna need is some type of chain link necklace. Um, it doesn't have to be a super expensive one. I actually picked this one up from JCPenney's and it just looks good on its own or paired with other items. And I don't know how it's gonna look with what I have on right now, but we'll go ahead and put it on, girl. So that little, it has like a little piece that goes through a circle and that goes in the front, there we go. So I would more than likely wear this alone, but it is definitely a statement necklace and it reminds me of the Chanel camera bag that I used to have that I sold that I regret selling, okay? I'm gonna pop up a picture of it, but it has that same chain link and that's what really attracted me to this necklace. It is a little bit edgy, but also very classy at the same time. Okay, so the next thing that you need is a pair of statement earrings. Now, all these chain link earrings, necklaces, all that kind of jazz, all that kind of stuff is very on trend right now. So I kind of like to lean towards the edgy side of the earring trend as well as the classy. So I have a selection of both. So this is the first pair and I picked these up from JCPenney's as well. I'll try to link them if I can. And they just look really cute, just like layered with another pair of earrings. I only have two holes at the bottom, then I have one at the top. So I generally try to do something fun here. But when I'm not wearing these, I'll go ahead and pop on some just like really classic ladylike earrings. Okay, let me take off the necklace because we're doing too much right now. Too much at once. All right, so I'll go ahead and take these out along with the second pair. And the second pair is just like a pair of Huggies that I picked up from TJ Maxx, nothing too special. Okay, look at that. Isn't that so classy? So, so classy. You just transform your whole look with this like circular clip on earring. I just love it so, so much. And then sometimes I'll also, they here, okay. <laughs> I also pair, or wear these hoops sometimes. I wanna find a smaller pair. I had a smaller pair, but they ended up turning. So I'm still looking for that perfect, chunky, smaller hoop. So if you've seen any, let me know in the comment section. Put me on, okay. Um, so yeah, I love these hoops too. They just give you a different vibe. And when I wear these hoops, I'll go ahead and put these little, oh my gosh, don't judge me for my nails, okay? Because I just painted them today, but they're already ruined. So I'll just wear like this little huggy that I picked up. I don't know if the camera is gonna catch that. Um, maybe I'll insert a picture, but it's a tiny, tiny little earring. I wear it in my second hole. It has like a butterfly with like some stones in it at the top and then a little dangling diamond at the bottom, okay. So yeah, that's what I'll normally do. And it just like from on one side, you just look one way. 
okay <laughs> and then the other side you just look like you're just ready ready to go to a tea party yeah so yeah i really love how each one of these look and again here's that little first earring that i had in like the chain link super cute all right so let's move on to the next thing that i just have been loving okay i think i'm gonna go ahead and put in my other little clip on because i'm liking the vibe that i'm getting from that it's okay to change during the video it's okay yeah we can change okay good so the next thing is to have some type of statement bag it doesn't have to be an expensive bag it can be any bag a colorful bag right now would be super cute and i actually have one over there it's pink but i don't know if i can get to it because it's kind of like towards the back of my storage or wardrobe. But you can just pop on any bag and it's just gonna elevate your outfit that much more. And so, yeah, I just really love how that looks. It's super cute, super polished, classy. And then the black blazer um, gives you like the edge factor that you're looking for. You can also wear, like I have this bag, but I think it will be too much black on black. This is a vintage Gucci as well. So it kind of gets a little bit like washed out, but if you end up having something a little bit more spicy, like this chain belt that I have on right now, it would be a good idea to wear like a more subtle bag. It'll kind of tone down whatever else you have going on. So that is very, very cute. And this is like a Gucci jacket. So I love that so, so much. Okay, so the first one was a Gucci jacket, a vintage Gucci jacket. This one is like kind of similar, like a hobo style. Love them both. All right, so we covered bags. What else is on our list? Okay, we got the, oh, the sandals. You need it. Mm-hmm, you do. They're over here. Okay, so I just featured these in one of my more recent videos. This is a pair of statement sandals. It's in this beautiful, like hot orange color, fire, help. Fire don't need to be put out. She's on, this girl is on fire. Okay, vibe. I don't even know what I'm trying to say, but she definitely needs you a good pair of sandals. They are gonna just like, mm, just take you over the edge. And yeah, look at that. I don't have them on right now. I have on a different pair, but just look how good, okay? And the blazer is the next thing. You need an oversized blazer. I would say start out with a black one because it's gonna match with many, many things, okay? Any color. And then you need it to be oversized long and you don't need it to be too structured. I would go with a one that's not so structured before I went with one that was super structured, okay? So, yeah, this is one that I picked up from Express. And I think it's in a size large. It's super oversized, so you can wear this as a dress or you can wear it just draped over um, your outfit. You can wear it with shorts underneath. You can wear a dress underneath. Or like I said, wear it as a dress. Go ahead and belt it up. Okay guys, so I'm sorry if you hear the noise. My office is right off of our AC unit. So obviously we have it on auto. So when it gets too hot, it's gonna turn on and you're gonna hear it, but just focus on the fashion, focus on the fashion, okay? So um, the next thing is a statement. Okay, I told you about the statement pair of sandals, like the mules. If you're not into mules, I think you definitely should get into it. Let me just say that first, because they are making so many different cute styles of mules. If you're not able to walk in a very high heel, they actually have like, you know, a mid to lower heel. And then they also make the little kitten heels as well as the flat sandals that kind of resemble the mules. Um, but just make sure, I guess I would say, go with the square toe that's more on trend. I don't know how long that's gonna be around, but I think they're gonna be around for a while because they're super cute, everybody's into it, and so yeah. Okay, so the next item that I search high and low for are my dad's sandals. Let me grab them. Cool, I'm trying to keep them away from my face, okay? <laughs> this is the pair of sandals that you never knew you needed, okay? A lot of people don't get it. I understand, I understand, but I'm a fashion girl. And as soon as I saw these, I already knew what time it was, okay? I knew exactly what time it was. I didn't jump on the bandwagon right away, regrettably, but I ended up scoring these um, about a month ago. Um, I scored them maybe like two months ago, the sizing wasn't right. And then I ended up finding them again in the same color. Sorry if I'm talking fast. I am 
talking a little fast, but I guess I'm getting so excited. But this is the pair of sandals that you never knew you needed. They are so comfy. Okay, so I went ahead and slipped on my dad sandals. I feel like they are gonna complement any, any outfits. And let me just bring you guys up a little bit. Yeah, they're gonna complement any outfit. I just have on a pair of mom jeans. Okay, and then I have on this blazer and they're just like so super cool. Yeah, it just gives off such cool girl vibes. So let me just show you how I would style them. Same outfit, I have the bag on, oversized blazer, sunglasses, just like get out of my face. No, <laughs> that's not nice. But I mean, they kind of give off a vibe like cause people can't see through them. So it's like, you know, they cover your eyes, they're very like, um, oh my gosh, I can't think of the word. <laughs> I didn't mean get out of my face, okay? But I mean, they just like, you're just hidden behind them. That's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, um, they just look good with any and everything. I just love this vibe so much. I almost love the blazer like not coming open, but I just really love it like just swallowing you. Just how good, you have to tell me. It's just, it's too good. Too good. And then if you have, for bonus points, I would go ahead and put on a chunky watch, okay? It doesn't have to be an expensive one. Just go ahead and put on a chunky watch and some type of bracelet, do like some type of layering situation and you're really gonna be in there, okay? So I still have on my chain belt under here. I don't know if I would leave that on, if I would want that to be seen or not, but I mean, if you get like a little pop if the wind blows, like it'll be okay. Super cute. Now, I think this might be too much. You will have to either take one thing off. You have to take one thing off to wear this, okay? This one is definitely gonna elevate your outfit. This is also a bonus point, okay? It doesn't have to be an expensive brooch, but I would definitely get some type of fun brooch, maybe gold, maybe a colored one would be fun for the spring. You just go ahead and pop it on. I actually haven't put it on this blazer yet, so we're gonna do it together. Hopefully I get it on the first try for the sake of time. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 but I would have to take off the chain belt, okay? This is just what we're looking like. Yeah. Okay guys, so I almost forgot to share with you the importance of having a really good bodysuit. Um, a bodysuit is just gonna really pull everything together and it's gonna snatch you in. So if you're wearing some jeans that may not be super flattering, it's gonna act as an undergarment, okay? But not one that's gonna like make you feel super like um, restricted okay so I just have a couple here oh, it's trying to fall off the hanger come here girl the next bodysuit that I have is one that I picked up from Ross actually and it has like the little feathers around the neckline guys this is so so cute and it was um I think it was like around $12 and so it looks super cute whenever I pair it with jeans or shorts or you know um, under our blazer for example if I had this on right now It's just gonna add a little bit of like fun and flair to any outfit. This is how it will look. I just love that so, so much. And they have these sleeper pajamas now that cost a fortune, which I do love. And I would love to have one one day. Is it at the top of my list? Not, not really, but I do love them a lot. And so you get that same vibe for much, much less. So do not sleep on Ross, do not sleep on Ross. Okay, so the last one that I have here is one that I picked up from Nordstrom Rack and it is a white one, just a plain white tee, has the thong bottom, love it so much, pairs easily with any and everything, just like a white tee would. So yeah, that's it. Okay guys, so that was it. Thank you so much for tuning into this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you had a laugh or two at me being a little bit goofy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on your way out. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.